Top 10 Manhua or Manhua, where MC is reborn as rich. If you are a fan of Manhua or Manhua and you love stories about characters who get a second chance at life, then you won't want to miss this list of the top 10 Manhua or Manhua, where MC is reborn as a rich. In this video, we'll be counting down the best webtoons featuring protagonists who go from rags to riches using their knowledge from their past lives to make a fortune in their new ones. From tales of loves and revenge to action-packed adventures, this Manhua and Manhua have it all. So sit back, relax and get ready to add some new titles to your reading list. Starting off with our number 10, Reborn Rich. Our MC, Yeon Woo, who after working hard for 13 years for the Sun Yang Group, the largest corporation in South Korea, finds himself betrayed by the royal family. When he thinks all is lost, he suddenly wakes up in the body of Do Jun Chen, the youngest grandson of the founder and CEO of Sun Yang, having traveled back in time. With this second chance, he sets out to seek revenge against his evil relatives. I was so intrigued by this story that I even watched the live-action TV series adaptation, which is amazing. It was my first gay drama and I have to say, it definitely lived up to the hype. The performances were top-notch and the set was so well-crafted. I just can't get enough of it. But let's talk about the manual itself. The plot is great, the characters are well developed and the storyline is engaging. There is really nothing to dislike about it. And of course, the artwork is fantastic. So, whether you are a fan of Manhua or just looking for a great read, Reborn Rich is definitely worth checking out. Trust me, you won't be regretting it. Number 9. The Legendary Return This Manhua story of Zhang Taishan, a down-on-his-luck stock trader who saves a child from a speeding car but dies in the process. However, he's reborn 14 years in the past as a high schooler, but with all his memories intact, including his knowledge of every top stock. With his family's finances in dire straits, it's up to Tyson to use his market foresight to change their fate. But this time around, he's determined to be a success and make his mark. With his past life experience to guide him, there is no doubt that his success will be legendary. I have been thoroughly enjoying this manhwa. It's full of suspense, comedy, and some really smart and occasionally dumb info dumps. If you are a fan of great storytelling and well-crafted characters, then Legendary Return is definitely worth checking out. Number 8. Lord of Money Soon Chang Wook's life was a living hell. Working for the abusive Chun Jung Myung, the third son of the powerful Ji Kyung group. But when Chang Wook finally quits, Jung Myung tries to kill him, and they both end up switching bodies after being electrocuted. Now, Chang Wook must uncover the mystery of his new identity while waging a war against Jung Myung's older brothers for controlling of the company. The odds may be against him, but lightning could strike twice. Although there is barely any action in this manual, it has a unique appeal for those who love business and enjoy seeing the growth and intelligence of the main character. If you are a fan of revenge stories and are interested in the premise of a bodyguard fight against a wealthy family to inherit their company, then the lot of money is definitely worth checking out. Number 7. A Man's Man Manual fans, have you heard of a man's man? It's a unique take on the reincarnation or isekai genre that sets itself apart from the rest. The main character goes back in time, but instead of immediately becoming a wealthy magnate, he focuses on fixing his past mistakes and repairing relationships with his friends and family. It's a character-focused story that uses the settings as a background to showcase the character's growth. This manhwa is a deep dive into toxic work culture and provides an adult take on the issue. It resonates with people who work in a corporate environment and the story emphasizes the importance of balancing work and personal life. You can be ambitious and competitive while prioritizing your family and peers. The manual provides a good analysis of human relationships in the workplace and in life in general. A man's man is truly a hidden gem worth checking out. Number 6. 
losing money to be a tycoon. This manhwa with a unique take on the reincarnation genre, P. Kian is reincarnated 10 years back in a parallel timeline and given a system that provides him with a fixed funding. He must use this funding to invest in projects and if the project succeeds, he will receive only 1 out of 100 of the profit. But if it fails, he will receive all of the funds back. So, he decides to make a crappy game that is sure to fail. What's great about this manhwa is that it doesn't rely on cliche characters or setting like many other Chinese manhwas do. The characters are well written and the conversations feel immersive. The art is also decent, although there is no action since it's a business-focused manhwa with the system. If you are looking for something new and good, then losing money to be a tycoon is highly recommended. Moving on to our number 5. Past Life Regressor In Past Life Regressor, the main character is a hunter who almost dies at the hands of powerful hunters monopolizing dungeons. After his death, a status window appears offering to reset time and he chooses to be reborn in order to become more powerful. Armed with knowledge of the future, he invests in stocks and becomes a billionaire all while trying to monopolize dungeons to make the world a better place. This manhwa is a slow burn, with a focus on trading and business instead of non-stop action. While the main character becomes a billionaire early on, the real action doesn't start until chapter 18. So, be patient if you are looking for a fast-paced story. The art is normal for a drama but scales up during fighting scenes and the characters are well written. Overall, Past Life Regressa is a unique and interesting take on the reincarnation or isekai genre that is worth checking out if you enjoy slower paced stories with a focus on business and dungeon crawling. Number 4. Back to the City – The Strongest Investment King Back to the City, The Strongest Investment King is a manhwa that takes an interesting approach to the idea of reincarnation. The main character, Yan Mu, is given a second chance at life and returns to the day he proposed to his wife with all his money intact. He decides to use his knowledge of the future to become the strongest investment king in the history. The story is filled with a mix of drama, romance, and business strategy. Yan Mu's journey is one of financial success and self-discovery as he learns from his past mistakes and works towards a better future. The art is well done and the characters are well written, with Yan Mu being a relatable protagonist. The pacing is fast and the plot twist will keep you on the edge of your seat. Overall, Back of the City, The Strongest Investment King is a great manhwa for anyone interested in business and finance with a touch of romance and action. Number 3. The Lord's Coins Aren't Decreasing This manhwa that will take you on a journey of revenge, power, and interdimensional trading. Our main character, our own steel guard, was living the life of his dreams thanks to a book that allowed him to trade across dimensions. Unfortunately, his enemies take everything away from him, including his life. However, fate gives him another chance as he's brought back as his younger self, armed with past knowledge and a thirst for revenge. Now, Aaron is free to amass coins and rise up the ranks of the interdimensional trading markets, gaining powerful abilities along the way. But will he gain enough coins to survive his journey of vengeance and reclaim his honor? I personally love the concept of being reborn into a past life, especially in a medieval world setting. The story and art are both top-notch, but I have to admit that some of the characters fell a bit short for me. Overall, The Lord's Coins Are Decreasing is a must-read for anyone who enjoys a good revenge plot and interdimensional trading shenanigans. Number 2. Again My Life Have you ever wished you could go back in time and set things right? Well, that's exactly what the main character in Again My Life gets to do. Kim Hee Woo, a hot-blooded prosecutor, is killed while chasing Torrent who controlled Korea. But he is given a second chance by a Grim Reaper who sends him back to when he was 18 years old. With his past knowledge, he prepares to punish the Torrent, Joe Tai Sup, and bring him down. This manhwa is perfect for those who enjoy battles of wit and brain power. It's a satisfying read with proper thrills and plot twists. While some may compare it to other similar stories, Again My Life can stand on its own. 
The focus is on complicated plans and slow downfalls of antagonists as the main characters strip their powers bit by bit. Character development is not the main focus, but the comic doesn't leave them without any growth. So, if you are into mind games and strategies, Again My Life is definitely worth a read. And finally number 1. As the richest man, I don't want to be reborn. Are you dreaming of becoming rich and living the good life? Look no further than As the Richest Man, I Don't Want to Be Reborn. Meet Wan Kiong, the richest man in the world who is ready to teach you how to get rich and fulfill your wildest dreams. Whether it's in a world of wuxia, cultivation, sci-fi or magic, Wan Kiong has the skills to make you a millionaire. Join him on his journey as he shows you how to earn tons of money and become the envy of all. This manhwa is truly amazing and I enjoyed it thoroughly. I love the concept of a character who is all about getting rich and showing others how to do it. While it may not be perfect, it is certainly interesting and worth a read. If you are someone who loves to dream big and live large, then as the richest man, I don't want to be reborn is the manhwa for you. And that's a wrap for our top 10 manhwa or manhua where the MC is reborn as rich. We hope you enjoyed this list and found some new titles to add to your reading list. Whether you are a fan of stories about second chances or just love to see characters climb the ranks of society, this manhwa or manhua are sure to satisfy your craving for wealth and success. Don't forget to leave a comment below and let us know which of these titles is your favorite or if you missed any of your top picks. And as always, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more exciting content on all things about Manhua and Manhua. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video. Happy reading!